FolioLink promo pages are found under the Site Content tab in the left-hand Sections menu. To create a set, click Add Promo Set. Now add a promo set title. This title is for your eyes only and will not publish on the page. Now add an image. Depending on your promo page design, this image may or may not publish, but it's good to have for your own identification purposes. Now click on the Promo Set Properties tab. Use the drop-down menu to select a promo set design layout. For now, let's use the Versailles layout. At the end of this video, we'll discuss the features of all current promo set designs. If you don't want to rely on the default design settings, you can use the built-in tools in Layout Colors and Attributes to control the look of your promo page. You can change these values at any time. Promo page customization is covered in another video, so for now, we'll stick to the defaults. The next item to edit is what we call Brand, but you can think of it as the page title. This is what you'll see when you visit your page. People often add their name here or something that identifies the subject matter of the page. The next field is very important. In fact, you might get a warning if you try to save your page without editing this field. It controls the promo page's URL. While you can rely on the auto-generated address, it will make much more sense to your audience if you customize this field. Here we have the description field. This isn't a required field, but it's useful if you want to add text to your page. Here you might describe a recent shoot, a gallery opening, or another event or project. Another tutorial will go over how to customize the description text. Here are some good examples of promo pages using text. Notice you can add links to other sites and even embed a video. How to embed video will be covered in another tutorial. This is just to show you how the videos can look. This next section allows you to decide what type of links, if any, that you wish to share with your promo set. Each link setting is optional. At the bottom of the form, click Submit. Before we can preview the Versailles design, we need to add images to the page. To add images, just click on Upload Promo Images. Once you have added your images, you can preview your Versailles promo set. To preview, click on the eye icon under the promo set at the left side. Now let's look at the set we just created in some other design layouts. Here is the Golden Gate promo set. Notice the menu panel and the way the images fill the screen. You can also set the images to fit the screen rather than fill. Fill gives a great cinematic effect, whereas fit is a good option to avoid any cropping around the margins. You can retract the menu, or even set the menu to auto-retract after a given number of seconds. Here is the Golden Gate 2 design. This design suppresses the menu panel, which is useful if you just want to show a slideshow of images. The Central Park design works well for slideshows too. If you have any questions, we invite you to contact us by email at info at foliolink.com or by phone at 1-877-863-6546.